Hi guys, so in this video I'm just going to be teaching you the basics of clicker training. Clicker training is very rewarding and fun for you and your rabbit. Just remember to stay consistent and it will really pay off in the end. I use my tongue instead of using a clicker, but you can buy clickers at local pet stores. Clicker training is great because it increases the bond that you have with your rabbit, so stay tuned and I'll teach you how to do it. So the first thing that you're going to want to do before you start clicker training is to find a fairly small enclosed area for you and your bunny. I chose a hallway so I had to go ahead and close all of the doors in that area so it would be completely safe and no distractions. Um, and also you can put down a rug for some traction and I keep some paper towels around so you can clean up any messes. So the first thing you're going to need for clicker training is some treats. So get out a cutting board and treats like carrots, bananas, or just store-bought treats. And then you'll also need a plastic bag or something to keep the treats in and a knife. And then if you need to cut your treats, um, go ahead and cut them into small bite-sized pieces. Um, you don't want the training to last much longer than 10 or 15 minutes, so just make sure that the treats are pretty small. Then if you're using carrots, you'll just take whatever's left and put it into a Ziploc bag, and you can go ahead and put that in the fridge. Then once you're done with that, you can take your bite-sized treats and put them into a baggie or bottle, and then you can go back to your enclosed area and start clicker training. This is just where Willie and I clicker train. Um, make sure that you do it alone with your rabbit so that he's not distracted by other people or animals. So now we're just going to go ahead and get started. So now you're just going to take one of your treats and you're going to pick a command to say slowly and clearly and lead the rabbit along the path that you want him to take in order to do the trick. So here I'm just teaching him how to come to his name and I'm just leading him towards me using the treat. Once he does the command correctly, I will click my tongue twice and then he will get a treat. Make sure that he gets lots of praise if he does the command correctly. Willie, come here. Willie. Good boy. And just remember to be repetitive and consistent and just don't give up because it can sometimes take a while to teach them a command. They'll just get a hang of it and it'll really help your bond get a lot stronger with your rabbit. Remember, if your rabbit does the command incorrectly, make a certain sound so that they know that they did the wrong thing. And of course, if they get distracted or do the command wrong, they don't get a treat. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope this helped. Bye!